maybe you want to have a record of the uh, very first xerography if you perform the experiment at the Transmediale in the Pneumatic Circus. There is a way uh, to perform it without uh, preparing paper with wax, which isn't so difficult because you can use a small uh, tea light in Germany and cover an ordinary piece of paper with a s thin uh, layer of wax. But there's a, another opportunity which is to wet normal paper or better, even better, a uh, photo paper for an inkjet printer or another photo paper and with this which is uh, adhesive you can get some kind of copy and we will try it now. Charging the sulfur layer putting the slide on it and exposing to the light for 10 to 20 seconds depends on the humidity and you have to try it but 10 to 20 you can't overexpose it because the letters are really dense black so I can talk without counting which I would do uh, normally so this must be enough, I think. You catch it. And um, Cover it with a thin layer of this rather coarse toner made from black tea. You see it's a bad photocopy. <laughs> we are used to it. But it will serve for this transfer. This paper is wetted. But it could also be covered with um, wax. Anyway, the toner I put in the capsule isn't good for transfers. This just serves to show the principle that Carlson and Corni used to make the print. And you see the wet paper is sticky enough to make a permanent photocopy if you put some hairspray on it it won't uh, it, it will not disappear so quickly because this is just dust on paper if it's dry you can wipe it away just like in an unfixed photocopy or a laser print so that's it <laughs>